Hey, this is Lonnie Spector. We're here at the New York Amp Show 2012. We're here with Mike Kosky at the Exits Amplification Room at the show. And uh, Michael, what what is going on, man? What is what's happened? How you been? I haven't seen you in a while for one thing, and it's so great to have you out here. So you've been in hibernation and working hard and uh, redefining what Exits is going to be, and I still don't absolutely 100% fully know what that is, but you know, I was going to show up this year come hell or high water, man. I'm here. He is here. Here's proof. He's here, right here. And uh, so the basic concept of Exits Amps and the I know that the e the X10 has been like a extremely popular and back ordered model. Can you tell us what makes the X10 such a special amp? It's Incredibly simple. It's compact. Actually, I designed this originally when I was thinking about this like several years ago. I envisioned it to be like like a taxi cab kind of amp, like something portable. You could have an extension cabinet. You could throw it in the cab, go do your gig, and um, it sounded great, sound big, and I don't know. It's kind of fun to actually have one in New York. Yay. It's only been like four years now. So. I know. It's like four years. He always threatens to, you know, come out and do the shows, and for one reason or another, you know, there's some reason it doesn't happen. But he's actually here, and so if you people out there that are on the uh, the back order waiting list, you will be getting your amps at sometime in the future. I don't know when. Do you know when? I don't know. He doesn't know. No one knows. It's one of those mysteries of the universe, like when is an asteroid going to hit the Earth? When will dinosaurs <laughs> return? When will the second coming? It's all of those things all rolled into one in exits amps. And you, you make, uh, well, you make, I know you made an amp called the Piper. Is that still in production? or? Pipers are still made. Sadies are still made. There actually is going to be an X100. The X50s are still kind of hanging on there. And actually, there's going to be an X45, which is going to be really super cool. It's actually kind of a super lead bass kind of thing. So, well, I don't know. Obviously. So tell us about, I, you know, your cabinets are some of the more interesting as far as the coverings that you choose. You, anything you want to say about, you know, what it is that, what, what story with the, those cool fabrics? And oh, well, actually, they're going to change. So very soon, I'm not going to use this any longer, and it's going to be new and different and much better. So so these will be like kind of collectible, like first generation uh, yeah. look Most things. Likely. So that's pretty cool. There was some rumor about you injecting the cabinets with helium to make them lighter. Is that true? I didn't know that got out, but that's kind of cool. I like that. So. Okay. Well, <laughs> there you have it. That's news from Exits Amps from uh, some remote location in Iowa, I believe. And, and uh, yeah, But who knows where. And, and John from Celestian in the John house. John from Celestian. Thank you, John, for <laughs> like the, helping you know, on the guitar. Celestian hangs out with me. That's like <laughs> that's pretty cool. Like, finally, it's like you know, there's justification right there, man. <laughs> so, if people want to know more about uh, how to you know uh, purchase your amps, uh, is there like one main dealer, or is it a direct thing, or what's happening, or who do they contact? What's the web address of whoever they contact? Um, the websites www exits xits hyphen sound.com go to the contact page you'll get a hold of justin justin can take care of anything as far as like questions concerns if somebody wants to send money yeah we can take that too so. <laughs> <laughs> well there you have it from michael kosky of exits amp this is lonnie specter at the new york amp show 2012 and uh over and out <laughs>